All right, let's get back to it. Super cool. Like this, <laughs> it's one of the few games that I'm doing right now where <clears throat> when I'm done recording, I can like process it for a couple minutes and then just like go, all right, back to it. Here we go. So that's what I intend to do. We're going to try and face uh, Roland or whatever this dude's name is. Duel, huh? Looks like you've got some decent cards too. Okay, whatever then. Just this once. Please don't lose. <laughs> I don't want to lose here. Good starting hand. I can deal with this. I can do my famous combo here. The the Wrath of Zaylis combo of <laughs> sacrificing your monsters then dark holing. But I don't think I need to here. God, I can't wait to use Barrel Dragon's effect. This is the first time I've actually drawn him. I'm excited to see if this works out. Oh, you know what I just realized? It's probably, you can only, probably only do it on the turn that you summon him. I also don't think I drew Pot of Greed that entire last match. No, it's just the turn you summon him on. Okay. That's all right. Um, do I attack? Yeah, I can probably attack with you. Oh, they, maybe they aren't that strong. They said they have like 1200 monsters, but like it didn't say... I assume that meant that they would be playing them every turn. That doesn't seem to be the case, though. Um, let's play this monster in defense mode. Kind of force him to attack. God, this is annoying. It just delays me. It doesn't even stop me. Here, got him. Okay. Got my Twin Hinted Thunder Dragon, and then got my Barrel Dragon. You know, actually, wait, it's weird. Barrel Dragon has his uh, Japanese art. I'm sorry, he has Barrel Dragon is the American art, because his Japanese art is like some literal fucking revolvers. But this one has his weird, like, laser beams. Dark Energy. Uh, powers of Dark Being by 500 points, okay. My rare card. What a disgusting outcome. Yeah, you fucking suck, dude. <laughs> Get wrecked, loser. Alright, we'll do the uh, dual thing. I don't know if I can duel Mokuba. I think he probably won't let me. He'll probably be like, duel the dual computer instead, because my big bro said that. It's whatever. Um, I'm just, I think I have to go to the aquarium. I think Mako's probably the uh, the final locator card. I don't know how much longer the, how much more of this game there is. Which feels weird. I don't feel like we're in the end game at all. Okay. Not me, duel the machine. I am dual robot, do you wish to duel? Data upload complete, dual start. All right. Anting up against a fucking dual machine. This music is also kind of intense. Uh, I don't have a trap card. Which could be an issue. Okay, I can work with that. Well, not really. I don't have a trap. Um, huh. I'll do this. Continue trying to draw for a better card here. There we go. That's the good shit. Then I can do Toad Master next turn. Yeah, this will work out. Okay. Yeah. Oh, when it says it's its turn, it, it's all in caps. That's pretty funny. I like that. Okay, good. Good move. It's my turn. Or it is my turn. Oof. Don't like to see it. Um... I mean, I can do a uh, Blacklist of Soldier. I don't know if I need to from this set of cards, though. I think I'd rather just go with Twin Hit Thunder Dragon. Hey, don't have, like, whatever beats Twin Hit Thunder Dragon. That would be very cringe. We hate cringe here. Okay. Wicked Dragon Eraser Head, whatever its name is. Why do they all warn me about the 1200 monsters? I'm not fighting any of them. I feel like uh, a bunch of liars. 
or on the internet. But people wouldn't do that, right? They wouldn't just go on the internet just to tell lies, right? That's crazy talk. Oh, there's Dark Magician. No one the only. I wonder what the end game of this, uh, of this game looks like. Okay, they had Lord of D at least. Dual victory. <laughs> System shutdown. <laughs> uh, deck capacity increased by five. 5,000 domino. Ryukushin powered. Hey, I needed one of you. Your victory has been confirmed. Okay, thanks, man. So I guess if you want money, that's the way to grind it. Is just keep dueling the dual computer. He gets 5,000 each time. Uh, which is, I guess isn't terrible, but... Not really what I'm looking for. I'm more looking for deck cost. Uh, yep. Gotta do, uh... Gotta go to the aquarium next. That was my suspicion. As it's the only area I haven't explored. I wonder if they're gonna make me go to the roof of that office complex later. To do a tag duel or something. I wonder how a tag duel would even work in this, in this game. Aquarium, huh? Don't know if I'm gonna find any duelists here. Oh, you're a duelist? Well, it must be Dumb Destiny to meet here. Dumb Destiny? What? That's not a thing. Oh, it's Umi. Ah, oh, fuck. I hate water, water fields. This is not gonna work in my favor. Him going first is also bad for me. Oh, right. What's his name? Weather. <laughs> Uh, I can destroy one of his cards, but not multiple of them. This is bad. I might actually lose here. Okay, that's better. Still not great. You're an aqua type, right? Surely this should mean you're powered up here. Okay, I'll take that. That worked out in my favor. I need one of those sacrifice monsters, please. It's actually pretty important. I could wait and try and get more monsters caught up in this, but I kind of feel like this is a attack now, try and eliminate his fields situation. Whoo, lad. I'm getting stronger. Ah, there it is. I made the right call. Oh, but another one. Interesting. Cyberjar becoming the, the strong monster he was always meant to be. I I remember really liking Cyberjar when I got it when I was a kid. Because it had a really fun effect, which was uh, when it flipped, you threw out your hand and then you drew up to five. And then whatever monsters you drew from that five that could be uh, special summoned, it would uh, you would then have to special summon. I'm going to get rid of one of these because I think Frog the Jam is probably stronger here. Yeah, I think it's 920 or 910. Yeah. Interesting. Frog of the Jam actually pulling its weight. It's gelatinous weight. Just barely. That was tough. All for Monster Eye? Fuck you. I don't care about the cards in my opponent's hand. It's good you. You got some awfully good cards there. Yeah, I don't know if I agree with you. Oh, you can see the orca in the uh, the tank. I'm sorry, the killer whale. Killer whale. Check it out. That oh, it is an orca. <laughs> that orca is gigantic. Yeah, really, it's really something huge. Imagine getting bitten by that thing. But it hurt. Okay, so if I try and challenge him to a duel, I just start talking about the orca. Huh, duel? Like you really want to? You know, I'm like totally strong. Are you? Also totally strong. <laughs> oh my god, it's all Umi here. Stop it. <laughs> I don't want to keep fucking. I don't want to keep going in the water. Okay, that, that works slightly better. Uh, that doesn't help, though. Uh, we'll play Cyberjar first. Hope for the best. I also just noticed my Dharma Cannon has been powered down. I think there's only three or two, maybe two or three field spell cards in this game that actually power down other monsters, so... 
That's not very poggers. Hey, whatever you do, go for Skellingel. Fuck. No! Oh my god. Where did all of my sacrifice monsters go? Did they just disappear? What the fuck happened? Oh my god, oh, no! <laughs> can't win like this. Ah, <laughs> please! This this deck kind of relies on more cards. Oh, Root Water too. I can't even... Oh my god, dude. Am I going to lose here? <laughs> no! How many cards have I drawn? Ten? And fucking none of them have been sacrificed monsters? That's a one in four chance. What do you mean? Well, this sucks. I don't really have a good way to turn this around unless I draw Regeki. I might finally lose Skull Spectre. It might finally happen. I hate you, game. I hate you so much. You stupid pile of shit. Goddamn stupid prick. Fuck. Goddamn. I should have filled my deck with Thunder Monsters. That sucks. Bad draw. Two bad draws in a row. I don't feel good about that. I don't have. I don't like the fact that I had two bad draws in a row. Also, you can hold down and circle the run. I just realized that. <sighs> that sucks. God damn it. What am I gonna do here? I don't really know what to do. Revival Jam would be fun to put in, but I gotta take out a hefty card to add it in right now. Um, let's see. Fiend Sword? Or Bolt Eskinal? You're a you cost money. Uh, or you cost a sacrifice. Um, what is your uh, thing? Oh, you can power up a Harpy's Pet Dragon. Okay. Yeah, I don't know if that's going to come in handy. I'm bummed out. Oh, I know what I'll do. Hold on. Let me get rid of, uh... Let me get rid of some of the uh, weaker monsters in my deck. Again. I'll add in more traps. Uh, Dharma Cannon, you can take off. You've served your purpose. And then I'm gonna get rid of, uh, Niwatori as well. And focus on, um, Mask of Darkness. Which should be roughly the same. We'll add in another Torrential Tribute. The reason I liked Sp Skull Spectre the most was that uh, it was very easy to find at the beginning. Like, it was very easy to select it as a, a card to auction off. I might have to go buy one just to just to have it back. <laughs> uh, I could fit another one too. Let's see. Do I get rid of a monster for this? Let's get rid of this dude. Perfect. Loading my deck up with garbage cards. I can stall as long as I need. I can't believe I have to go buy a Skull Spectre now. <laughs> this feels wrong. Oh, interesting. The Masked Beast is just a normal summon card. That's so weird. It's just a normal two, two summon monster? Alright, I'll buy one. Uh... Cybertech Alligator is a really good card. If its cost is insane, of course it is. Uh, then, or I didn't mean to buy you, but all right. <laughs> I meant to just check your ability. Um, okay. We'll go way to the bottom here. I gotta find my boy. The Skull Spectre. Where would you be? Watch it not be in here. Actually, let's sort my number. Uh, number two. All right, I'll buy Mystical Elf so that I can constantly wager Mystical Elf. I think that's a better uh, a better way to do it. Oh yeah, I can sort by cost. That's a fun way to do it. I want to see what the zero cost cards are because I guarantee they shouldn't be zero cost. 
some of them at least. Okay, another bear trap. It is wild this cost too. Although I guess it's gonna start being outpaced. You know, Tama doesn't do what's supposed to do in this either. Messenger of Peace do. Oh, it works kind of like it does normally, but just not really. Ooh, stop defense could be fun. And cheap. I didn't even think about stop defense. Uh, do you still... 200 damage for every card in the foe's hand. That is still pretty good. That's still a pretty good amount of damage. I'm gonna build a burn deck in this game of all games. Uh... What's this one? Oh, anti Uh, Widespread Ruin. Yeah, this just destroys any monster that attacks it, which is wild. I have three in my deck. <laughs> I didn't need to buy more, but that's fine. Crush Card Virus. Attack of minimum. Okay, so it destroys all monsters above 1500 attack point. But doesn't do the thing where it destroys them in the deck, which is what it's known for. Uh, another dark hole, more field spells. What do these cost? Forty. Hmm. Mm. Oh, here we go. Spectral figure that joins others to befriend doom foes. Victory is automatic if the final message is complete. So do I just have to do it in all? the areas? I don't know what to do with that. What do I do with that info? I could buy some thunder monsters. I'm not going to, though. This doesn't seem necessary. Uh, Alright. I think I bought enough here. God, I can't believe I have to do the fucking walk of shame right now. Uh, let's see. I have a lot of traps. I have a lot of monsters. I mean, I don't really know that, that there's that much that I would change here. I can add something up to 120. Uh, or up to 114. Anything below that, I can add it. So let's, let's start looking. We're getting somewhat close. 114. Maybe I'm not getting close. 103. And this is the one that, uh... Pull all monsters in the field and drown them in a swamp. Yeah, fuck it. In the deck you go. Okay. I can't believe I lost. I finally lost. It took so long. All it took was a bad draw. On a rematch. I think it's because I talk so much shit to him. <laughs> Finally, a fucking trap card, dude, and goddamn sacrifice cards. I can win this. Adios, Jesus Christos. Oh, I could do this this plan. We'll see. What does your thing do again? So it specifically only powers up those three monsters. Were those the only three zombies back then? I'm so annoyed. <laughs> I'm so annoyed. It was just bad luck. Like my card, they're definitely starting to play cards that are stronger than mine. And there's not much I can do about that. But also, it's kind of bullshit. Feels slightly targeted. Um, let's, let's do Doran again. Because that'll buy me another turn. I can just get them to play defensively, I can summon more monsters. Well, you're powered up, that's pretty good. Let me read your effect one more time. All monsters in the field, okay, so including mine. Okay. Let me play you next turn, I don't know. My current plan is to do this. Just get a stronger monster out there, deal more damage. Boom, 
Oh, I powered down my own card! I swear I've played this game before. Uh-oh. These field spells are no joke. Also, yeah, I hit three Toad Masters and none of those fucks decided to show up. Just want to throw that out there. Okay. <laughs> Very close to beating. Very close to winning with Frog the Jam. Ah, never mind. Rip the dream. Um, yeah, let's do that. How many life points do they have? Uh, 600. Okay, let's see if this works. Oh, interesting. It destroys itself as well. That's concerning. Uh oh, your boy fucked up here. Hey, don't sacrifice any monsters or I'll be really sad. I'm gonna be really sad. I can already feel it. I threw it away! Because <laughs> I wanted to test an ability. I hate. I just hate. Alright, what do you have? 900? Alright, I'm gonna fight back. Mutually assured destruction here. Oh my god, I fucked up so bad. Hey, give me another Toadmaster, please. Or one of the, my thousands of traps in the deck, please. Thank you. I am genuinely appreciative. Uh, okay. You gotta start playing defense. Okay. Getting real slow here. Dragging it out. Okay. Still dragging it out. Oh my god. No! Please. Okay. Toadmaster, please. Or Torrential Tribute, please. I will take it. Buys me a turn. Oh! The Mad Lad! Twice this asshole beat me. Oh my god, I'm gonna fucking lose it! That's my own fault. I can't even be mad. That one was my own fault. I might as well have thrown. I had the victory and I cleared my entire fucking field. I did not think it would also destroy itself, and that's where, why I lost. I was convinced that it would at least, uh. It would at least leave itself alive, and then I could finish it off that way. I had no fucking idea it was gonna do that. That is upsetting. I'm actually losing cards. This dude is really strong. He's not messing around. Alright, this is a good starting hand. I can I can work magic with this. This will last me a couple turns. I do need a stronger monster still, but it'll it'll do for now. That's 2700 off the rip. Next turn will be uh, 3600. And then the turn after that, we'll see. There we go. Now we're hitting harder. Okay. Good. Love to see it. The deck is working as intended. It's like half traps at this point. It fucking should work as intended. Alright, no more messing around. <laughs> I got Genin. Why couldn't I have gotten jo uh, Jonin? Is that it? Genin, Junin, Jonin? Is that right? It's been a long time since I read Naruto. I've been thinking about, uh, gosh, this kid's like being a total jerk. Can you shred him with your deck, baby? I'm gonna pay you back double punk for her to take your look. She beat me twice. What do you mean? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna, uh, I'm thinking about rereading Narada. Oh, Barrel Dragon. No, what have they done to you, my boy? 1300, 1365. Fuck. Fuck. This should buy me some time. Not as much as I need, but it should be by me sometime. We'll see. Okay, 
so I can swing over that, which is good. That's progress. I need at least two. I need two monsters out at once, which is going to take me a little bit. Ah, that doesn't work. Oh, that sucks. Okay. Yeah. I need two monsters in the field at once, and the second they can destroy Toadmaster, they will. Oh, you're killing me right now, game. Absolutely killing me. I guess I don't have to play them in defense mode. I could try and chip away at their life points, but that, I don't think that's as important to me. I'd rather save my own life points. Also, you guys have like the same deck. What do you mean, save me, whatever your name is? Oh, now they fucking defend. You bastard. Well, I have my one Thunder type. That's fun. Wow, he was totally ready to go for me. I don't know what typing uh, Penguin Warrior is, but that threw me off guard a little bit. I didn't think anyone could uh, could try and pick off Twin Thunder Dragon. That was uh, a little scary. A little spooky. Doing monstrous damage with my Thunder Dragon in this water. Conan the Sword Mistress. Oh, you! Oh, wow, I did not realize she had torpedo boobs. Uh, <laughs> I, I use her a lot in Fallspawn Kingdom, but not by choice. Also, really, really, Takashi? Seriously strong. Alright, bye guys. You ruined my life, thank you. You're in my goddamn streak. Oh, not legendary, <laughs> legendary uh, fisherman. Darn it, I can't win. Ha 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 ha. Do you like the power of my sea deck? Didn't didn't Joey win this fight? I have a sea deck, so I'm kind of like Maku Tsunami. I think I'll be useful for you to study. I should be as strong as him. Do with me. Uh, okay, this makes me nervous. <laughs> I love the little uh, commentary they give you. I'm like, oh me? Okay, I guess. This is a pretty good starting hand, actually. I actually have monsters that can swing over. It's crazy. What a world we live in. Ah, oh, here we go. Now the fun starts. Now that we got Frog to jam here. Oh, wait, no! He had Eatigaboon! No! Oh my god, I can't believe it. My Frog to jam in, in pieces. No. He was so innocent. Uh... I think I'm going to start blue eyes here. I don't know, 20 seconds? Yeah, we'll do blue eyes. I'll do the uh, the old Razzle Dazzle here. And uh, defend so he destroys his monsters. Fucking moron. Idiot, is this your first duel? <laughs> this is why I lose, because I trash talk so much. It's karma. I remember uh, I used to deal at a card shop when I was a kid. Not very well, but I used to do it. And, uh... Oh, no! <laughs> Rewind! Why are you off still? Alright. That was enough for me. Hate my fucking life right now. Uh, he used to say, uh... Remember, no trash talking. We don't want you to sound like Seto Kaiba in here. Like, we're just out trying to have fun. There are a lot of kids here. And I remember thinking, like, yeah, that's probably a good idea. I can't believe I'm going to lose this. Again! Because I fucking threw it away. I hate this so much, dude. Oh my god, my own worst enemy. That's two duels in one fucking game. I've, or one part I've thrown. I'm losing it. Does it help if I say it's 11.30 p.m.? And I'm tired. And this is my sixth video I've recorded today. Does that earn me any... Goodwill, any? Just like a crumb of goodwill. My life points are, are like n negative. They're null at this point. All right, I think I can slowly claw my way back from this, despite clearly having the win. <laughs> so stupid. 
Why am I in this position? How did this happen to me? How could this happen to me? Yep, thought that might happen. Well, at least I'm getting closer to a clearness field. Okay, now some of my water monsters have decided to show up. I mean, the easy answer to this is just to create a water in that thunder deck, and you can probably breeze through this. The problem is that... I don't want to do that. <laughs> no, the real problem is that, uh... You don't have multiple deck lists in this. So I can't just, like, do that and then go back to my main deck, unfortunately. This game would really have benefited from, um... From multiple deck lists. Because the cost mechanic is, uh... Kind of brutal. And that would let you kind of alleviate it a little bit. Where you could make, like, a, uh... You could keep making new decks. I feel like such a fucking moron right now. <laughs> Effect! Up to three monsters in the foe's field to be wiped out at a 50% sex success rate. Good, it worked out. Could have just attacked, but that's no fun. God. <laughs> Dude, this has been a fucking... This has been a duel. This has been a match. Let me fucking tell you. This has been a match. Sword Hunter, huh? Ah, oh, it's not good enough. My deck's not ready. No, it's... You're fine. Don't worry about it. Girl, that guy's deck is pretty darn, darn strong. Can't find his weak points. Hey, how do you think I'd be able to win? I don't know, Joseph. They're all water monsters. And apparently sigils exist in this game. Just use thunder monsters. Simulation good? Yeah, let's duel Joey. Let's... What could be the... What's the worst that could happen here? Joey, I immediately think I know why you're losing. Just... Just... For your information. You're, uh... You have not incre You have not improved your deck since our last duel. And I think that's going against you. God, remember when these were the cards we were fighting? It was very easy back then. Now I just need the witch to show up, and I can, uh, can sweep as I power up all these cards at once. Next turn, I'm going to play uh, Feral Impid Defense Mode, and then it'll wipe out his card, and then that'll be game. Because the AI cannot resist a juicy defense card. Forbidden Memories came or was back and forth. Sometimes they would they wouldn't attack, and sometimes they would. This game they they can't help it. They're like compelled to attack. Like some dark force, Just calling their name, drawing them in. Well, thanks, Joseph. I needed the uh, I needed the victory. B Skull Dragon. Wow, that was worth it. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? What do you mean, Beast Skull Dragon? She came pretty close, so we'll be able to keep winning like this. I don't think fusion exists in this game. What the fuck, dude? Alright. Who am I taking out? Alright, I think I'm finally getting rid of Gaia. Getting rid of Gaia. I'm tempted to get rid of Feral Dragon, but not yet. Um... Get rid of something. Let's get rid of the uh, Black Quest Ritual card because I don't think the cost of these cards is going to be terribly high. Ooh, wait. Why is your cost randomly high? That doesn't make any fucking sense. Why is your cost somehow higher than Beast Gold Dragons? What? He's beat you in every way. I the cost has to have been fucking random, dude. It doesn't make any other. There's there's no other explanation. I have very, very, very little room here. Um, alligator Sword, 25, do it. Why not? For the fucking memes. We'll put Alligator Sword in. Despite having much better sacrifice cards. <laughs> Doesn't matter, whatever. Who cares? You're not bad at dueling, not bad at all. I have to win this tournament. Earn the big prize money. If anyone gets my way, don't expect any mercy. You'll find we will your wheelers little pal have you squeal and you and me will play for our locator cards. We're way past the warm stage. Boy are we. You know what I've had to go through for this? You have no idea. You son of a bitch. The things I've sacrificed. Uh did not get a sacrifice. It's fine. We'll just We'll go mini beatdown. 
What's what's the term for a beatdown deck, but like your cards are weak? Is it like death by a thousand cuts? Like <laughs> another to totally awesome. All right, let's do it. I don't know why I called him totally awesome. His name is not that. His name is uh, Toadmaster. Okay. Hey, guess who's a fucking moron, by the way, and was not paying attention and just destroyed two of his cards against it. I can't believe I did it twice. I just, like, completely zoned out. I was like... I was like, no, I don't need to do this. It's fine. I, I don't know what's happened to me. Something has, like, changed my brain. But it's, like, making me a worse duelist. I don't particularly, uh, enjoy it. Just gonna play Regeki. Here's hoping I don't just decide to wipe out my fucking field. Oh my god, it was Torrential Tribute. Uh, no, no, that was fair and square. I'm not gonna rewind. He got me, dead to rights. I can't, uh, I can't go back on that. There's nothing I would have done to change that. I can't believe he has Torrential Tribute. What a fucking madman. All right. We got the Witch's Apprentice uh, strat going, though. We can come back from this. I cannot believe he had Torrential Tribute. That's wild. Okay. Nice, nice, nice. I love that this strategy actually works. It's super cool that it does. It's fun, too. And Pot Agreed, what do you got for me? There's a tribute of my own. Nice. Increased by 30, 5,000 Domino, Legendary Fisherman. Not a great card. Because he requires a sacrifice. My ultimate C deck! Pa, I'm sorry, Pa. Way to play, Nick. He's never going to see his father now. <laughs> Thanks, Joey. Locator card was obtained. Card shark. Oh. oh. That's pretty good, actually. That's a good one. All right. I did not enjoy those duels. I don't know where to go now. I could look at a guide, but let's let's explore first. When in doubt, just check... Uh, uh, check Yugi. Or check the card shop. I haven't heard anything from the Rare Hunters in a while. Oh my god, an actual cutscene. Joey Wheeler came by a while ago. No, he didn't. I was just with him. He left with Taya Gardner. There was something odd about him, though. Oh, we're doing this part. Are we going to do the anchor duel? I just got back now, too. I'm getting a very bad feeling about this. Oh, cutscene. Oh, I wanted to duel Yugi. Who are you? We are the ghouls. We have your friends Joey Wheeler and Taya Gardner. If you value their lives, do as we say. Hand over your decks and quit the tournament. No. You ain't brave, are you? But know this, we are serious. You'll come to regret this. I like how I can just say no. These kidnappers. Taya and Joey are in serious trouble. Let's split up and look for them. They must be near. This isn't the time for that, Nick. I just want to duel you, Yugi. I never got a chance. All right, that's fair. Okay, Nick, this is what we'll do. We find any clues, we come back here. Okay, let's get going. That is a very short plan. You gave me very little to go on there. Alright, let's check uh, the old guide here. Uh... Oh, interesting. Wow, okay, so I gotta defeat a bunch of ghouls. Uh, so you if you travel to some districts in Domino City you'll notice it has been invaded by the evil ghouls to continue the story you must defeat the ghouls at Clock Tower Square both Northeastern Alleyway and Cemetery Aquarium Bridge and Art Museum at least once uh, if you defeat a ghoul the ghoul will leave an area temporarily if you exit the area he'll appear there again beat the ghouls repeatedly they'll each give you uh, roughly 2,800 to 4,700 domino. Specialize in... I don't care about that. When you have defeated the ghouls at the above districts at least once, they will appear at the park. Uh, tr take the eastern path to see someone defeating Weevil, which is not canon. Uh, and then you can duel them. 
Uh, okay, there's there's a lot going on here. Uh, so we're just gonna take this the first step. Defeat all the ghouls. So it seems like they've appeared in some of the places where uh, other people were. I guess that's the hint. Bloody ghouls. They beat me and kicked me out. You better watch yourself too. Yeah, they're, they're diverting from the story a little bit here. The duelist left here have defeated. You two shall join the vanquished. I don't think so. I'm getting my confidence back because you don't have a water deck. So you can't beat me. <laughs> Wait. You take three sacrifices? Oh my god, I'm so stupid. That's why your cost is five. Okay. I mean, that's still... No oh, I fucked up here. I'm losing it. I gotta stop. I gotta start paying attention. Uh, this is why... Uh, um, what was I going to say? This is why some of the... Uh, my brain's not working. I need, hold on, I need to re reload for a second. Um, this is why you don't record at like 11 p.m. <laughs> is because I my brain does not have any fucking function right now. Alright, that should be enough to win me the duel from here. I like the summon Dark Magician though. Because they get the dark bonus. Perfect. Just what I needed. Yeah, they're not that strong. And they don't seem to have decks that like actually mesh with this that well. Oh, perfect. Here we go. Uh... I summon the evil Dark Magician, given to me by one of the own rare hunters. Ooh, Regeki? Yeah, let's do it. I did it again! This is why I turned Rewind back on. <laughs> My stupid brain doesn't know what it's doing anymore. Do you know what it is? It's, uh... I actually know exactly what I'm... It's because it's muscle memory. Because in every other Yu-Gi-Oh game, every single one... <laughs> not everyone, but most of them. You press circle... And then you hit right, and then you go to the end phase. This one just ends the turn. But in the every all the other ones, like Legacy of the Duelist and Master Duel, you hit the button, and then you go all the way to the right, and you hit end phase. And my brain just, like, when I stop paying attention, I go on autopilot. My brain just like, yeah, this is what you wanted to do, right? I'm like, no. No, it wasn't. <laughs> it's not at all what I wanted to do. I need to bait him out a little bit, and I can't, because I can't get another monster in the field. Oh, he has Exodia. Interesting. Wait, does that mean he can win by Exodia? That would be, uh, not very poggers. Okay. Ooh, lad. Grand Tiki Elder. Oh, boy. But, but it can't be. Lose to you? How could this happen? Girl, don't forget this. Okay. Later, loser. Yeah, a little ding is to say, like, hey, you did a good job. Okay, Bones is gone, too, because they took over his graveyard again. Coo -coo -coo -coo, this tournament's such a gathering of the week. Hasn't been a good one yet. Coo -coo -coo, you look as if you need me to beat you, too. No. I'm, I'm back in the groove again. You can't, win, you can't win against the me of now. I'm much stronger than I was before. Maybe not that much stronger. Um, fuck. Ah, shit. I need more cards. Okay, that'll work. I can work with that. Oh, he... what did they play? What the fuck did you play? What did you do? If he doesn't attack, I'll just forget you. Or Torrential Tribute will just take care of it for me. That's also an option. It is weird how good the uh, the sacrifice mechanic is for just winning duels. Like, suspiciously so. Like, I don't know. Sacrificing shouldn't be that good for, like, winning duels, but it absolutely is in this game. The attack power difference is crazy, especially with all the monsters that can create copies of themselves. Hannibal Necromancer. Oh, they're all dropping actual rare, rare hunter cards, which is interesting. What?! Get you back for this. You won't, though. 
All right, art museum, aquarium. Uh, basically kicked everyone out. So I just gotta remember where everyone uh, was. Oh, and the bridge. Surprisingly not the park. Aquarium. My old nemesis. I can just walk around. Oh, there's two of them. Also, for what it's worth, when you talk to them, they just instantly go into a duel. They're not like, oh, do you want to get your deck ready? That doesn't happen, believe it or not. Nice. Alright. Oh, this is going to be fun. I'm going to do that strategy in a little bit. Which is a... Uh, which is assistant or which is apprentice is going to be much stronger here than before. Uh, okay. Yeah, I do have a mostly dark deck, so this actually works in my favor. And I feel like Merrick's goons are going to use dark decks for like the rest of the game, including Merrick himself. So this really does work out in my favor. Because <laughs> I've kind of built my deck around it. The only one I'm particularly worried about is uh, Yugi. Because Yugi has a lot of dark monsters, but I think I'll still be okay. Nice. Oh, wait. Feral Imp didn't count for that. That's odd. Shit. I think I wasted that. Should have just waited to attack. I would have had enough to kill. That's three. I know we're running a little long. Er, we're actually not running that long. I thought we were going longer. These have gone really fast. Fire Reaper. Directly inflict 50 life points. Why would I ever want to do that? Okay. Like the little jingle. All right, we gotta go to the art museum. Just says art. <laughs> You. You possess rare cards. Those cards I claim in the name of the ghouls. Do I possess rare cards? Could you name them for me? And tell me which ones they are? Um, hmm. I actually think the only way I can survive this turn is if I uh, do this. So they're slightly stronger. And even then, I'm not super... Ah, oh, dark hole. Ugh... That sucks. Uh-oh. This is bad. Uh-oh. They're just slightly stronger. Okay. That's sort... That'll buy me some time, but not enough. Uh... Uh-oh. That actually won't buy me any time. I can't be either of them. Oh, no! I'm gonna lose. I don't have any cards. I need Regeki. I need the Beast King, I need Dark Hole, I, I, uh, that works. Take that. Thank you. For buying me some time. Oh god, no. Okay. Um, discard that one, and I'll discard this one. Maybe say, Nick, why didn't you discard Beast Skull Dragon? It's like, because I believe in the dream. I'd like to summon him one day. Ideally. <laughs> okay, good. I can summon Pump King, and then I don't think they can swing above that. I want. I could have played a little bit riskier and tried to go for a double summon, but I'm a little too worried about my survivability right now. So, I'm just gonna just gonna duel correctly, which is sometimes less fun, but I would like to win. Alligator Sword, Mask of Darkness, okay. Yeah. They had a couple good good cards, and they, they started with them, but much like... Again, this reminds me of food, Forbidden Memories. If you can get past the Onslaught of their opening hand, you can usually do pretty okay. Um, I'm gonna do it for the memes. Hell yeah. <laughs> I don't need this card in my deck at all, but it's fun. 
it's good practice because uh, I do intend to uh, put the god cards in my deck at some point. And they require three sacrifices. Slifer is apparently, uh, you can apparently break the game with Slifer. How did I, did I have a trap card that I didn't play? Wild. Couldn't be me. I wonder why I didn't attack. Oh, maybe it was a Dreams type. Or, uh, I'm sorry, maybe it was a Fiend. Strong, are you? But this is merely the beginning. Alright, we gotta go to the bridge. I'm across this wooden board to fight you, and this stagnant water. We have the ghouls of assumed control. All duelists should be eradicated. Exterminate! Exterminate! Alright, here's a good fucking opening hand. This is that good shit. I'm gonna play Dark Hole and Harvey's Feather Duster. Ooh, we love to see it. That was very good timing. Huge, huge attack. I like how I didn't realize why, uh... <laughs> how I didn't realize why, um... What's his face? Um... Why Beast Skull Dragon's attack was so high. Or cost was so low compared to... Richer mass beast. Just didn't even clock it. I was just like, oh, that's weird. <laughs> Why would it be like that? That doesn't make any sense. Casual 3,700 attack points from a Dark Magician. You're goddamn right. Gatekeeper. Oh, I've seen this card before. I think it's card something else, isn't it? Don't think this is over. I, in fact, do think it's over. I think that was all the ghouls that I had to fight. Be interesting if they challenge you Pokemon style if you like walked in front of them. Oh, maybe I didn't. Did I skip one? We did Esperoba's ghoul. And they respawned too. Maybe I gotta do the graveyard one again? The rave in the grave? I don't know where else it would be. Maybe the park? I'll try fighting this dude again. I don't think he, I don't think this one made a, a noise last time. Remember when he said it won't go the way it did last time? He's right, but for the wrong reasons. are stronger depending on who they're replaced. That would be an interesting mechanic. Kind of softly implying they beat those duelists to get out of there. I mean, they did flat out say they beat Bones and uh, Esperoba, so... I don't know, it's weird. It feels weird that they're basically, like, jobbing these uh, these characters. Maybe maybe this is where the, uh, the manga left off. Maybe this is the part where uh, this is as far as they can go in the game, because this did not happen. It could just be them trying to figure out something to do for uh, the character. But it feels a little weird. We're in like original story territory. Also, no, I don't know, because there's a part from later. There's a part from the anime, I think, because I don't think it was in the manga. Where, uh, where my duel's that like Hollywood guy. Or uh, you can duel him for her. I don't think that's in the manga, so the anime must have been out this at this point, which means they had like the exact script to go off of. I don't know. I have no idea when this game came out in relation to like the anime and the manga. Nubia the Wicked, four stars, two thousand attack, no effect, three nineteen costs. Didn't get a beep that time. Huh. Well, maybe the park? I guess I beat Weevil. Oh, yeah, here's one. I assume it's one from every area, so this would make sense. Dark Thorns, huh? Well, 
This may be uh, useless if I don't... Uh... Oh, I should have played both. Oh, I fucked up. I... I don't know, I got... I've been going first so many times, I forgot how this works. My brain just, like, skipped for a second. I, again, I just keep making dumb mistakes. I gotta... I gotta go to bed. <laughs> That's what I gotta do. What do you want souls? Interesting. Oh, there's Regeki. I actually would have preferred a monster to Regeki that time. One of the rare moments. Okay. Still can't win, but I can do decent. I kinda wish there was a trap now too, because then I could summon Beast Skull Dragon again. But I don't think I need to. Now I'll use Ryaki. Okay. That's game. Stone statue of the Aztecs. Ah, another defensive monster. Things over. No beep there either. That's so weird. Huh. And like literally you just go to a different area, huh? Uh into the bridge. Maybe the building? They don't seem to they don't seem to care. Uh Card shop. Why? Also, why does it say building and not arcade? I guess that there's other floors. Maybe the card shop. I have no idea. I feel like I should have uh, already progressed based on the game or based on the guide. Hmm. We will check this. Uh, let's see. You must defeat the ghouls at Clock Tower Square, both the Northeastern Alley and Cemetery. Okay, I did both of those. Aquarium, Bridge, and Art Museum at least once. I've defeated all of them. What do you mean? Maybe, I don't know. I can't... I mean, the obvious answer is just keep fighting them until eventually the story progresses. So I guess I'll just keep fighting him in different areas. Hope for uh, different results. Oh, you know what it might be? Maybe you have to fight, maybe you have to get all the different dialogue from them. Maybe they all count as like different rare hunters. I'm just spitballing, I genuinely have no idea. Uh, just, just, that just seems like it could be real. Okay, that one's down. Are you out there? Or that there? Just attack. Buy myself some time, but unless I get a better monster, they will eventually beat me. I've got traps, but only last for so long. Okay, actually, this will work. Sort of. They're gonna start chipping away at my monsters, but I'll at least be able to power myself up enough to swing over whatever they can summon. As long as they don't go for it this turn. Yeah. For a card called Skull Stalker and a card that looks like that, it's actually very weak. Like, surprisingly weak. I don't remember if it has an effect in the main game either. Okay. It should be this turn. Alright. Burglar? No beep. Okay. We do them there. Not the building. Card or clock tower square. Bridge. Let's try the bridge. Let's see if there's they're in the other areas. Not there. Okay. I think there are two more areas here. Yeah, there's one there. I gotta go all the way around. The rare cards in the land belong to ghouls. We claim your cards for ourselves. Do you now? Well, they went first. Not my favorite. Okay. Uh, shit. I gotta be careful. 
They might be able to swing over this. Oh, okay. That worked out. Probably do this. They might attack uh, Mask of Darkness, but I should be okay. I'm gonna sacrifice them both for Dark Magician next turn. Oh, Dark Hole! Oh no. <laughs> Not like this. I gotta power up even if I get a free attack, because uh, I need to be able to attack. That'll work. Just gonna sacrifice it by itself for Pumpkin. Having a Dark Magician 2 would be great, but unfortunately I lost that chance. So I gotta go, uh, just gotta make whatever hits I can get. Okay. This should probably get them to attack. I'll summon, or I'll sacrifice for Alligator Sword. They didn't, okay. And do that, defend. I could get an attack over here, but I think this will be better. Because it'll force a trap card activation. And will get an even bigger free attack. Let's see. 1800 plus 1700. That's 3500. Okay, so it's still stronger than Dark Mission 2. I want to do the quick maths, because I wanted to know if uh, it was worth it to summon them from Dark Mission 2, but it is not. Oh man, this is taking forever. I know the video is running long here, but uh, I think it makes sense to wait until I get to the next story beat for this, so that's what I'm doing. I want to just clear this rare hunter thing before uh, before I get mixed up or whatever. Needle ball. You have a really weird effect in the actual game. Wait, you can leave that way? That's allowed? Oh, never mind. It's like I didn't think that was allowed. All right. The only place I haven't tried is the park. There are a couple I haven't beaten at the park. So we beat that one. We didn't beat this one. We didn't beat this one. Oh, we got a cutscene? Oh, I know this guy. Whoa. My insect queen had failed utterly. You don't have an insect queen anymore. You gave it to me. Yeah. You may have been the former Japanese champion, but you're nothing before me. In America. <laughs> why, why are you a ghoul? There's no need to explain to the likes of you. Power rules above all. Leave your deck and get lost. Maybe they had the maybe the uh, guide had this out of order. You have to do this part before doing my. <laughs> a new prey comes along, ripe for plucking. You fall victim to my new deck like the others. Is it still machines? Like the bandit Keith of old? Boy, I wish I started with a trap card. Uh, we'll do it this way. This should at least leave me one monster on the field. Yaiba Robo. No, he's he's using machines again. Manda Keith back on his bullshit. <laughs> um I'm gonna try and get sneaky here. I'm gonna play another monster. And then next hopefully Torrential Tribute triggers. And I can uh sacrifice them both next turn for Dark Magician. Ooh. What monster did you sacrifice for? We get the same plan. I think you gotta make Dark Magician the uh, the thumbnail on this one. The the original art, or I guess not the original. This is the second generation art, right? And let's power him up even stronger. Hey, I know the card. I have that card. I just don't want to get fucked over by like a random trap or spell card, so I gotta end this sooner than later. Um, just try and punch through. Big hit. Okay. That'll work. That'll play. Troll robot. He's got all these like weird like thousand attack point robots. Triple century. I think that means my. Deck cost? Wait, what does Triple Century mean? Did I get 3,000 deck cost? Or did I get 300 dual points? I don't know what that means. Dual victory. Your deck capacity increased by 30. About 20,000 domino was obtained. Barrel Dragon. Hello, old friend. Welcome back. Stroll in the park. 
You think you're good, huh? You must be. Uh, you must be to stand in the way of my vengeance. Where are my? Or where are my friends? Are you a friend of Wheeler's? You go tell Yugi this. Defying Master Merrick Ishtar is a waste of time. Pegasus is nothing compared to Master Ishtar. Ha ha! Be prepared to fall. All right, thanks. Uh, appreciate the uh, the candor there. Yeah, duelist level is 307. Wow, my duelist level's been skyrocketing. The deck capacity is uh, also kind of bumped up, too. Yeah, this is insane. I don't think Kaiba would let this happen in this tournament, I'm going to be honest. <laughs> Mostly the whole, like, they're being defeated and then not leaving part. One of my, fa <laughs> One of my favorite bits in Yu-Gi-Oh! is, uh... They do a zombie parody. Not really, but in a Yu-Gi-Oh! GX, some of the... It, it is a zombie parody. It's in Season 3. They, uh... They get trapped in the, uh... In the Dual Spirit World, or whatever it's called in that version, and, uh... All the duelists get, like, infected. Where they have this compulsion to duel non-stop. And basically, they just keep dueling, and then you beat them, and they get up and re-challenge you. And it's so funny that it's played as, like, a zombie situation. Because it's also, it's just like, it's like, oh my god, they keep dueling. It's like, can you just, like, not duel them? Like, <laughs> and it's just so funny. There, It's like, I, this has never happened before. Usually when I duel someone, they get down on their knees and they collapse and <laughs> they don't duel me anymore. Hey, Yugi, Nick. Got a good lead. Joey Wheeler was kidnapped. I heard from Tristan. That idiot, what was he doing? Mine, do you know anything? No, I don't know where Wheeler's whereabouts now, but Seto Kaiba should know exactly where Wheeler is. All duelists have a transponder built in. So the organizer can track the location of duel duelists. Go to Kaiba Corporation and speak to Seto Kaiba. Thank you, Mai. It's nothing. I'm worried about Wheeler and Taya. Hurry up and find them. Yeah, Nick, let's go. To be fair, that actually is... That is a plot point. That is exactly why, uh... Oh, he's following me! It's me and Yugi! Just the best of buds. Tristan just fucking apparated. Alright. Okay, thank you guys for watching. I'm going to end there because I'm exhausted. <laughs> and my, my dueling is showing that. So, thank you, and I will see you later. Goodbye.